Finding square of a number is very easy. We take a number, multiply it by itself, we get product and that product we call it as square of the number. We know many tricks and techniques to find square of a number. But what about the square root? Finding square root of a number, especially a non-perfect square, is not that easy. Even if you take numbers from 1 to 100, there are only 10 perfect squares. What about the rest? How do we find square root of those non-perfect square? And for sure, we are going to get decimal values. To find square root of such non-perfect square, we have a technique of long division. But long division is really long and many times we go wrong. So here is a technique, a simple technique to find square root of such non-perfect square, which is quite easy, quick and simple. Hello everyone, I am Sujay at Dr. Math. Today we will see how to find square root of such non-perfect squares. For this, we will take some examples. Let's say we have to find square root of 28. Step number one is to draw two squares like this. Write two here and a small circle. We just need to fill these three blanks now. Square root of 28 is little more than square root of 25. 25 is a perfect square. So square root of 25 is 5. Therefore, square root of 28 must be 5 point something. And we just need to find out what is that something. So let me write that 5 here. And write 5 here also. Okay, now think. 28 is how much more than 25? 28 is 3 more than 25. So let me write that excess part 3. And your answer is ready. So this is 5 plus 3 divided by 10. And what is 3 by 10? It is 0 0.3. So 5.03 is 5.3. Therefore, square root of 28 is approximately 5.3. Let me take another example. Say we have to find square root of 99. 99 is a non-perfect square and we are trying to find out the square root of 99. But 99 is very close to 100. So square root of 99 must be little less than square root of 100. And we all know that square root of 100 is 10. So square root of 99 must be little less than 10. Let's find out how much is that. As I have told you, just need to draw a square. Now since it is little less, let me write minus a circle, 2 and a square box. Square root of 99 is very close to square root of 100 which is 10. So let me write 10 in square box. But 99 is 1 less than 100. So let me write 1 here. So this is 10 minus 1 divided by 20. And what is 1 by 20? 1 by 20 is 0 0.05. So 10 minus 0 0.05 would be 9.95. Therefore, square root of 99 is approximately 9.95. That's really easy, right? Is it a magic? No, there is a logic. This is based on some approximation techniques in differentiation which comes under calculus. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and share.